Thanks, Senator Senator Reynolds. Oh, thank you very much, Chair. And first of all, I'd like to extend uh, my colleagues' congratulations to the Australian Customs Service. Um, as a Chief of Staff for Minister for Customs for three years, I know just the incredible range of work that your organisation and your staff does. And I know since I left, it's only got far more complicated an environment. So I'd just like you to, to perhaps to note and pass on sincere acknowledgement and thanks for the work that you and all of your staff do. Thank you. Uh, the first question I've got um, relates to your new Cape class uh, patrol vessels, or boats I should say, and I recently was down at Henderson and had the pleasure of seeing, I think it was number six or seven, uh, Cape Levique uh, being um, mm -hmm. prepared. And I just wondered if you could give, give us a bit of background to this project and uh, your thoughts on how, how happy you are or otherwise with the vessels. Well, let me start with the latter part of your question first. I'm very happy with the vessels, thank you. Uh, this has been an exceptional build program of vessels for the Australian Customs and Border Protection Service. Um, it commenced some years ago when we identified that the current um, fleet of Bay class Bay vessels class. that we have were ending their life cycle. Um, we had our project team put together a set of specifications in terms of both our learnings from mm -hmm. the, uh, the Bay class op vessel operations and what we were experiencing at the time in terms of uh, our, our operational duties on water. Uh, we entered into a uh, multi-hundred million dollar uh, contract to build eight Cape class vessels. Sorry, how much? Uh, multi-hundred million dollars. I don't have the yeah, exact figure right. for me. But, um, and I'm pleased to say that that build program is almost at an end. Um, we should take possession of our final two Cape class vessels sometime in the next couple of months. Um, they will be a, uh, a fleet of eight vessels that will fulfil the entire uh, range of maritime responsibilities that we have um, under our Border Protection Command. Uh, I'm pleased to say that the reports back from our operators in their marine unit is that these vessels are fit for purpose. Um, they are comfortable compared to the old Bay class vessels. They have greater range, greater endurance, more utility, and in fact um, are a, a a valuable asset in terms of uh, the Australian Customs and Border Protection Service mm -hmm. being able to maintain a uh, competent maritime capability. Thank you. And uh, coming from WA and uh, being a real champion of our local shipbuilders, it's uh, very pleasing to hear your words that it's an exceptional build and uh, that you're very happy with the with the product. Um, so, so as far as you're concerned, they have been delivered to the specifications that meet your requirements, would that be correct? Yes, that's correct, but with, as, as in any fleet of uh, vessel, um, as the first uh, couple roll off and are uh, put into operational trial and evaluation, there are little uh, bugs that need to be ironed out. Yep. Uh, we're working with our, um, our builders in Austell to mm -hmm. uh, work through those bugs, uh, but by and large, it's been a very successful program and a very successful boat. 